Hare Krishna. Praying to get our need fulfilled isn't our need. Praying is our need. When we pray to God, sometimes we may fear, what if this prayer is not fulfilled? If we ask something and if it doesn't come, then we may feel that our faith in God may weaken. And not only that, we may start raising questions. Does God really exist? Does God really care? Does God answer our prayers? And we may wonder how this whole phenomena of prayer works at all. Actually, we need to understand what our ultimate need is. Our ultimate need is not just to get a particular need fulfilled. Yes, that's important. And we can try to get that done. So the nature of the world is that there are finite resources and there are infinite desires. So sometimes some, some desires will just not be fulfilled. Of course, something we may feel is not just a desire, it's a vital need for us. That's okay. But even if that is not fulfilled, it's not the end of the world. As our mind tends to catastrophize and think. So, we, of course, we may say there's a particular problem and I need to solve it. Yes, it, it may be needed. But we have to recognize when we are agitated, when we are feeling deprived, when we are feeling uh, threatened, at that time, our greatest need is not just a solution of that problem. Our greatest need is to connect with Krishna and pacify ourselves. Once we are pacified, then we can find out how to practically deal with that problem. So if you understand that uh, with a calm mind, with a clear head, with, with, a, with composure, we can deal with any situation that comes in our way. And if we see prayer as a means to get things done from God, then sometimes if the things don't get done, we will feel prayer is useless. But if we see prayer as a means to connect with God, then we will see that actually God is always there with us. That, that in connection with Him, in experiencing His presence, we will experience calmness, we will experience clarity, we will experience composure. And that's why we focus not so much on, when praying also, we focus not so much on getting the thing done, but on getting connected with Krishna. Or not letting that things getting done come in the way of connecting with Krishna. Krishna says in 10 point in the Bhagavad Gita that we connect with him lovingly. And he will give us the intelligence to deal with whatever situation life may send our way. Desham satata yuktanam. Bhajatam priti purvakam tadami buddhi yogam tam yenamam upayantite tisham satata yuktanam with constant devotional disposition. Bhajatam priti purvakam we worship him and stay connected with him through bhakti. Then tadami buddhi yogam tam Krishna says, I'll give you the intelligence by which you can come to me, by which you can remove whatever obstacle is stopping you in your onward journey towards me. So if we understand that our primary need is not to get some external need fulfilled, our primary need is to connect with Krishna, then we will see that prayer always works. Thank you. Hare Krishna.